So good morning, wherever you are watching us from. This is Spoon TV. We are live here in the joint chamber of the Capitol building, where, as you can see in uh, these pictures, the vandalization of the joint uh, chamber. So this is where the uh, majority block of the House of Representatives hold their session, but we we only receive the news this morning about the deliberate um, destruction of these chairs by on new persons on new persons so as of yet there is no arrest no one has been connected to what is happening here and the we are hearing that the securities on ground will be conducting an investigation into this matter so you can see in the pictures a deliberate vandalization of this place you can see all the chairs have been of rooted so you can also tell that uh, this act was carried on by instrument used by instrument to off root these chairs so you will see on locals are here to look at what is happening here to their uh, dismayed to come and see the entire the entire uh, joint chamber uh, have been described. So these are also uh, split units or central units. Uh, air conditioning we want to assess to see whether it was also damaged. Okay, okay. So you can see the cables connecting to you can see the cable. We still want to know whether this was touched. Okay, so I don't want to believe that this um, air conditioner was uh, damaged also, but it is not on. It is not on. So I want to take you around. This is where the deputy speaker sits and he co-presiding also. In the table there, they sit uh, behind that table, but the table is just placed right here. So I want to see this other unit. I don't want to believe that it was also touched. But there is no electricity at the moment. So we will leave it to the technicians to tell us exactly what happened. But we can see some attempts. You can sense some attempts made on these uh, units. You can see uh, that the... The guys or the unknown persons who made them uh, made their way here try to attempt to uproot some of these things. Okay. So we we understand that the security will be launching investigation to ascertain okay what uh, happened and how did the people. The on new men uh, get here. So police have arrived on the scene um, to do their own assessment because this is criminal matter. Okay.
So the police is asking everyone out so that they can do their um, investigation or um, take photographs. I'm on security again. Are you going to stop it, man? I'm security. I'm going to get money again. so he was in a situation. I so you believe that it was on school eh? instead of someone just stepping into the school? Yeah. 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 They were not doing it. They were not doing it. So nobody passing into the police. So that's the patient's So I've been joined on set by Jokon Flama. Been covering um, activities here at the legislature. So to the so to everyone's surprise, this morning we are told about this situation.
Yeah, my brother. I see. Yeah, yeah. 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 So the police um, is assessing the the crime scene because this is um, highly uh, criminal for such a crime to you know uh, take place. You can see how organized how organized this crime is. Uh, from while we what we are hearing is that those unknown persons might have taken their own time to unschool these uh, chairs. So it might it might have happened at midnight, and the question will come: Where were the security officers? And also people will argue, why doesn't Capitol building have CC cameras? But all this and more are being joined by uh, Chokon, Chokon Flama. Chokon, welcome. Thank you, Haji. Thank you for making your way here this yeah. morning so we can be able to you know, broadcast this to the public. Many people are surprised, including journalists who cover, uh, you know, the House of Representatives and in the entire Capitol building. As you can see, this might be an organized, well-organized crowd to unscrew all of these seats. It says a lot. Because, mind you now, this is not a chair that has four legs, like the other chairs, you know, mm -hmm. normally I think you can see only a single leg screw onto the floor. So once the, the screws are removed, there's no way you can you can have the seat balanced for some someone to sit. But how be it, if this was connected to the entire Rickman Road on Capitol Hill concerning the removal of the speaker, the person just, maybe you are just, I would say they are just fighting a losing battle. Even if the guys want to hold session here like they normally do, they will, they will bring rubber chairs, plastic chairs here. So, so like so, the first day, they turn out the air conditions, so they, 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 they shut down the doors and all of that. But the guys were still here in the heat. Yeah. And you were here, you saw how they were sweating, but they were still sitting here. To, 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 to whole session. Uh, uh, so, like, uh, what you are, are saying, Chogon, um, if this place is not suitable enough for the majority members to hold session, they have the leverage or alternatives in the capital of Monrovia to, mm -hmm, hold, mm -hmm. to hold a as session per as per the rules, as per the constitution. Mm -hmm. But we'll not be perceiving with those um, uh, articles or, or so. But like in the case of, 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 of uh, Eldon Snow, the majority, the majority is you know, sort of, you know, the, uh, the whole session within the capital, also from in you know, the capital building that were on, you know, a renovation. And so I believe this block now can elect to hold a session at the Centennial Pavilion. It's available, it's functional, okay? And it's well intact, you have security. Even the Monrovia City Hall. Even the City Hall. They could move there to hold a session and all of that. It, it is permitted under the law right. of the country. So I, I, many people, like you said, will be wondering why the Capitol building does not have CCTV cameras to be able to 
uh, detect some of these uh, crimes, not only today, because there have been complaints that people have, you know, tips are gone to people offices to take away documents, to break into the offices and yeah. take away personal belonging. Right. You can recall when 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 Senator Amara uh, uh, Conan yeah, Amara was Conan investigating the, the yeah. famous uh, 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 GTN, you know, uh, in, uh, uh, deal with the governor of Liberia. Yes. All of the documents were were stolen from from his office. So CCTV camera, there should be the leads for this capital. Right, These are right. the people that appropriate right. the budget. They yeah. can so, shift money here and there. So speaking about that, um, the speaker is the chief administrator of Capitol Building. He can, you know, put in the budget, you know, for the procurement of, you know, CCTV. Mm -hmm. So, the, I mean, all corners of the Capitol need to have, you know, CCTV because not just entering the building alone, sometimes the, the vicinity of, you know, Capitol Building, mm -hmm. a criminal can mm -hmm. use, you know, the vicinity to commit crimes and... The person just go, you know, unspotted. Mm -hmm. Like in the case of uh, Senator Amara Conan, you know, you could not find a trace of, you know, of individuals who, you know, enter his office far the window. Mm -hmm. Imagine that. So it, the person came from outside. The person did not enter the building but used the window. Like in this case, I mean, if you had CCTV in uh, this John Timmer outside, you will trace somebody coming in, going out, and even committing this crime. Of course, of course, Haji. You know, not only the CCTV camera, but also the consistency of electricity here. You know how electricity can be fluctuating right. here and there. You can right. have the CCTV camera, but once the electricity is not stable, like always in the Capitol building, a lot of lawmakers have to purchase generator, mini generator to use for their offices. You know, these are not things that our Capitol building should be talking about in this 21st century. So, you know. so do you want to believe also that this person was aided in the process, or these people were, were aided in the process uh, with, you know, some higher ups or whatever because for people to come and sit sit took their own time and just on school all of the chairs i mean it speaks it speaks for them of course haji you can see from this like i said earlier on this is an organized crime there's no way that one person can do this job a single person cannot just walk in here and uh, unscrew yeah, all of these chairs okay. and walk away. Well, you and, uh, the book uh, 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 yeah. Uh, you know, and unscrew all of these seats yeah. and just walk it's away. Yeah. Maybe the the mark been maybe one, two, three, three persons mm -hmm. to have done this. You see. I, the lawmakers should also be concerned about, about the let, lives. Let, let's see one of this. This is a school we are talking about. This is it. So the person took their own time and on school all of the chairs. And we carried them. And we carried them. <laughs> you, so I was thinking when I saw photographs of the chairs, I thought the person just came and, you know, just stepped them and they, they were off rooted. But it is not the case. It is not the case. You can see the, it was on school. So see these holes. They were on school. Um, Mr. Henry Campbell, welcome to Spoon TV. Thank you, Roger. What's your own assessment about what is happening on Capitol Hill? And looking at this now, it has degenerated into destruction. I mean, I will speak to this as this opponent is I mean, I don't expect that people will go this far right. for power to remove or to, to retain you 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 want to you want to relate it to what is happening here? I've called all my sources 
We heard it was all renovation, but I've heard so sick in the terms of so many days. They are not aware of anything called renovation. Okay. Even if there were renovation, all going to see, would that be the first thing you remove? Right. Now, now, uh, capital, but I will tell you that. Right. Mind you, we just have January where the president is supposed to come in. Just so that the, in this very thing. This is the chain where the this president is, comes. This is the Liberian people money. This is, it's, it's beyond politics. Like, I mean, you like it or not, you can't do this to the country. This this place should not be a scene of, of such. Mm -hmm. you, can't, mm -hmm. you can't do this. I mean, I'm, I'm seriously disappointed. I don't, I'm not here to shit them because I don't know who did it. But whoever they has done this, it's unfortunate. You can't, you can't do this to the country. And, and surprisingly, up to this time, no one has been linked to uh, what happened here. I was Remember, I said it the other day. If you notice, uh, the deputy speaker chair that's in the meeting was, yeah. was brought here. Eh? We yeah. brought up the restriction. You, yeah. we, when we, we saw his chair here. How did they come here? So, I mean, they got, they, 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 the two teams have people working for them on, on the other side. But again, for me, I'm clear, I, I will say it is a result of ongoing crisis. But who did it, I don't want to say it, but it's unfortunate. You can't do this. You, you can't do this. Look, look, there's not a good picture for for us. Yeah. You can't have a vendor last. This is a sacred This is a, this is a sacred tumor. This is a sacred tumor for politics or position. You can't do this to your country. It's unfortunate. So, it's unfortunate. so do you think the uh, majority block in a quest to remove the speaker to hold extra, you know, the parallel, you know, session, do you think they can still use this place or anywhere in Monrovia? What's your reading? Well, I talked to some of the guys on the other side as well. They said, even if they remove this year, they will bring rubber chairs the whole session. But again, I don't, I don't want to buy into. I mean, anything could be possible. Yeah. It could be possible that this was seen by people from the quote unquote majority black mm -hmm. to create this scene, create the impression that somebody, the other guys are fighting. It's also, it could also be possible mm -hmm. that the other guys from that side could, could have done this to prevent the guys from holding session here. So anything is possible in this situation. So I don't want to, that, my point here is nobody should do this, regardless of what. Nobody should do this for the joint people. On the first day, uh, when the whole removal process started, you saw people led by Safoko chanting battle cry. Yeah, you it, know. Was, it, was, it, was it was visible. If you look there, all of the doors. And yeah, that was when the door yeah, was I, removed. I, I was here and I saw Marvin Co. representing Marvin Co. giving orders for people to block the door, lock, unlock the door. I mean, that was it. But the chairs were not, the, the building wasn't vendor last to do this thing. Mm -hmm. So, so th this is also on the back of information that tomorrow the president might take a decisive decision by submitting the budget to the 43 lawmakers. There's no change anything that I said. The guys, they can't allow me a rubber chair in our session. No. I'm not sure the constitution, I'm not a lawyer, but I'm not sure the constitution is specific about where, what they sit into who session. Right, yeah. eh? Or how they sit into who session. Mm -hmm. It looks specific about the place. So, the guys can even go and lay mats there and sit on there and do that. Why are they with their session? So that is not a, that's not the best solution to, to solve any problem. This, this is wrong. This is, this, for me, I'm not a lawyer, but if you ask me, I'll say this is reasonable. You can't do this to a country. You can't. It's wrong. Anything else before I leave you? I'm just, I'm just disappointed. Yeah, I can see your, your, yeah. your body, your, your posture. Yeah, yeah, I mean, as I'm a former yeah. slave for 12, 12 uh, years, I, 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 I follow all of the crisis, the people removal crisis, the impeachment of justice. Nothing like this was done. I mean, it's not about the power. I mean, you, what would we do with the power if we destroy everything? We saw it in the war. When people got that power and they killed all and destroyed the country, now we, we had to go back. Tomorrow, even if this, this crisis is settled, it's going to cost the country money to repair this thing. Sure. Or to get a new one. Sure. What, what, what? What's too much about the power? This is unfortunate. You can't do this because of power. You can't go to the extreme at this. This is, this is, this is unfortunate. Okay, Mr. Kamo, he is here in Kamo former president of Legis Pool, they rep all the journalists that cover the uh, Capitol building, he also reported for um, Front Page Africa for several years, and he's been in this building for 12 unbroken years, still counting. 
understanding uh, legislative politics. So I uh, would like to say thanks to Henry Camo. We will uh, continue to show you the um, aftermath of what took place, uh, what may be described as last night operations. And like you heard uh, Mr. Camo, he talked to some sources and said um, apparently um, this was ongoing uh, renovation uh, process, but nobody can, nobody in the hierarchy can um, attest to, you know, that there was or there is a, a, a renovation work going on. Not at all, but this is what happened. You can see for yourself in the uh, pictures. The person took their own time and unscrewed all of the chairs, or as though it was um, organized, well planned, and effectuated. You see this? All of them on school. So, so the person has the the school to. The person has the school to to everything, all the chairs here. Some of them remain. Apparently, they were in a hurry. But everything on school. So the person um, to sit and on school these things, meaning that the person was not in any hurry. They were not in any hurry. So we'd like to say thanks so much for watching Spoon TV. My name is Haji Masale. We will call it a day now on this uh, broadcast. We've been uh, bringing you live pictures from the joint chamber of the Capitol building, where, as you can see in the photographs, um, has been vandalized by a new person. Motives behind their... Um, their action, we cannot tell. We want to make this clear that we have not reported on or point accusing finger to anyone. The police will do their job. The internal security here will do their job and tell us who did this and hope the findings will be made public and the doers will be shamed. So my name is Haji. I say thanks so much for watching Spoon TV.